Starting a restaurant is one of the few major profitable business ventures anyone can go into. Any day, any time, the business of food can never be cut off by season or events. It is just for you to make sure you are operating the right kind of restaurant in the right location. At this point, let me mention that starting a very successful restaurant business is not as difficult as you think, irrespective of the size or capacity. In this video, I am going to break down the five strategic steps you need to follow if you want to set up a very, very successful restaurant business for yourself in any location of your choice. Step number one, identify the audience in your area. Of course, when trying to start a restaurant business, just like every other food business, your first responsibility is usually to identify the type of audience in your location of interest. Are they majorly students? workers, families, who are they, what is their age, what is their income level, what is their ethnicity or food culture. These are a few questions you must ask yourself as your step number one. And these questions, when you are able to provide solutions and answers to these questions, will definitely help you decide on your niche and develop a unique concept for your new restaurant proposal. You may have had the kind of idea or concept of a restaurant you want to kickstart, but remember, the type of audience you have available in your location of interest has a key role to play in deciding the concept or type or kind of restaurant that you must kickstart in that location if you want to be successful. Step number two, conduct your market survey. Having understood the kind of audience in your location, and decided on the type of design, the type of concept, the type of cuisines that you are going to offer in your new restaurant project based on the audience you have in your location. The next step, which is step number two, is to conduct your market survey. You must begin your market survey by checking the degree of saturation of restaurants that are offering similar concepts or exactly the same concept in your area. How many restaurants are doing the same thing? How many restaurants are doing similar things to the ones you want to do in that same location? Based on the number of menu items you have decided to kickstart your restaurant with, you have to check the profitability of that business. How profitable will the business be at the end of every month, given the number of cuisines or given the number of menu items you want to kickstart with? And finally, you have to check how possible the business will be for you based on your time because the restaurant business will definitely require your time, especially at the beginning stage. So you have to check how possible the business will be given your schedule. You have to check how available you are. You have to check the availability of the suppliers that you're going to get most of the items you'll be using. You have to also check the needed equipment. You have to check your amount of capital that is at your disposal to see if this business is possible for you to venture into it given the location and the concept you want to implement. Of course, if the capacity or size or concept of the restaurant you're looking to start would require much more money than you already have, we will be posting a video very soon to show you how you can go about the necessary restaurant equipment and initial capital if you do not have enough money to kickstart your business. And if this is your first time on this channel, do well to hit the subscription button to ensure you receive updates on all our new videos. Like, comment, and share this video with your friends and fellow restaurators or food business owners. Step number three, draft your business plan. The process of doing this is very simple and I would recommend you do it yourself. You can also consult a firm like RB Firm to do that for you. But making a business plan draft by yourself will help you to better understand the business you want to get into. It should include your branding procedure, your marketing plan, your equipment and staff needed. It should also include the business model you want to operate with. It should also include your financial analysis and finally your milestone. Your restaurant business plan should also capture your target audience and your list of initial offerings and how you intend to make money out of those offerings. Step number four is time to proceed for your business registration. Depending on your country, find out the body that is in charge or the body that is saddled with the responsibility of business incorporation and register your restaurants. If you are in Nigeria, then proceed to Corporate Affairs Commission Office in your state to register your restaurants. Step number five, 
haven't identified your target audience or done audience analysis on your location to discover the kind of people in that location and pick the exact restaurant concept that will resonate in that location and done your market survey to check the possibility of the business and the profitability of the business based on what is available to you in that location and also have written your business plan and filed in for your business registration it is time to secure your target outlet or property depending on your financial muscle or financial capacity if you were able to erect a restaurant of your own or you're able to rent it is time to secure the outlet once you have secured the outlet and hired the additional hands it is time to kick start this completes the five key steps of starting a very profitable restaurant business anywhere any day don't forget to hit the like and subscription buttons if you like this video see you in the next video